Hey guys, so today is a little bit of everything. We're gonna do a little bit of a physique update, kind of talk about how my cut is going, and then I am going to show you guys a tour of my gym before and after. So I just wanted to come on and do this quick little intro because a lot of you guys know if you saw my last video that 3S Fitness is doing a name your price sale and it is ending very soon and I just wanted to remind you guys because I'm not sure if I'm going to be posting another video before the sale ends but it is when you get to pick the price that you want to pay us for your first month of your health and fitness journey. We really like this because it allows you to have control over what you feel like this journey is worth to you right now. I build you a custom training program, I give you a flexible dieting plan and I work with you on your goals. You get to have access to everything. 3S Fitness. It's not anything that's a limited membership. You name your price and you get the full membership, our top tier package, everything that comes with a 3S Fitness monthly membership, um, but you get to tell us what you want to pay for your first month. So I want to just remind you of that and tell you to click the link below. Go check it out. Um, it's ending really soon, you guys. Those of you who have already signed up, I'm so excited to get you going and start training you. And if you want to take advantage of it, make sure to do so soon. I love you guys. So let's go ahead and get into the vlog. Do you think you're the boss man now? Huh? Do you think you're the boss man? Tell me. Do you think you're the boss man? I'm not doing much work. What's up YouTube? It's me back in all of my messy glory here. Um, today is cut day two and I have an exciting announcement to make which is that I don't know if it's our mattress. I don't know if it's left over from moving. I don't know if it's because I was hunched over unpacking, but my right rhomboid has flared up. It is freaking the F out. Um, I am getting a massage day at one. Actually, I just sat in my desk chair and I'm thinking it could have to do with that because I sat in my desk chair and I put two pillows behind me to support it. And um, I have felt the best I've felt in the last 24 hours. So I did not work out today, but I am down um, about another half pound. Um, I weighed in at 112.7 this morning. Um, I ate super clean yesterday. I hit all my macros. It was kind of amazing. I was a little under on carbs actually, but I was okay with that. And I had Halo Top last night. It was great. Um, but yeah, tonight is draft day. My, I have two friends coming over. We are doing like a girls league. And so we have people like all over the country, but two of the girls that are in Minnesota with me are coming over tonight to draft together. And we'll probably have a little bit of wine. Um, I'm, I'll probably have a little bit of tea and not wine. I don't really want to drink over the next couple weeks to really maximize the benefits of this cut for me. Um, but I'm feeling really good. I'll give you like a mini physique update. Um, oh, my stuff's kind of in the way, so you're just going to have to excuse it. But I definitely, so my abs are where I lean out the absolute fastest um, of any of any body part like my weight comes off my middle first so you can see they're really poking through it's making me incredibly happy and I just feel leaner um, even my oblique just kind of showing and honestly like I'm not flexing right now um, if I flex it is a little bit harder there and in the front you can see when I'm flexing but um, if I just kind of like leave it that's what we got the last place for weight to come off is my legs um, but I am kind of getting a little bit of a separation line there even though I haven't done much working out um, from moving walking stairs climbing walking a lot it's helping this side is always the most stubborn but I'm getting a little bit of a line there. I really want to cut some weight off my legs. I really wanted to bike this morning, um, but I didn't get, I didn't get to it because of my back. So this is kind of where I am. This is no spray tan, Abby. Hopefully I can get a spray tan here in the next couple days because I'm feeling so pale. But yeah, that's a little physique update for you. I don't know, nothing crazy exciting, but you know, we're getting there. I'm definitely feeling super good about being 112. My stage weight is was 110. Um, and again, I want to just preface this by saying that obviously I had more muscle mass, um, less body fat being on stage. I'm not like close to that physique right now, but um, I'm still getting like, I'm still dropping weight, which is good because it's really hard for me to lose weight, but, but that's because I'm on my maintenance macros, right? So when I'm on weight loss macros and if I follow them and stick to them, I usually do pretty well. So 
I'm really excited. Um, I love it. There's nothing like seeing progress when you're sticking to it. It's motivating. It's inspiring. I'm hoping this massage is going to help me out and I'm going to be able to bike a little bit later tonight. So fingers crossed. If not, I'm definitely going to get it in tomorrow morning. It's really not that hard on my upper back and I have my spin bike downstairs. Um, maybe I'll take you guys on a tour of my new home gym in a second here. But I had a banana for breakfast. I had um, my coffee with a little bit of creamer. And I'm getting ready to film a beauty video. I'm gonna go do my hair. So the next time you see me, hopefully I'll look a little bit better. It's only like 9.45 this morning. So um, yeah, I will see you guys in a little bit and we will do fun stuff. I don't know what, but we'll do fun stuff. Yeah, okay, bye. So I've just been sitting here editing and I have my massage in 28 minutes. And so I need to eat like aggressively aggressively need to eat. I just like have been sitting here trying to power through this because I really needed to get this video done for my beauty channel, guys. I'll give you a little sneak peek, you won't it? Although it's already gonna be up by the time you see this. It's totally fine, totally normal, check it out. Sorry, it's coming across so freaking bright with my camera, like filming my computer screen. Um, but if you want to see the rest of this video, it's going to be over my beauty channel. It's the nothing over $10 tag tutorial. It's going to be really fun. But I am eating some Boar's Head Honey Maple Turkey and some Boar's Head Asiago Mild and Creamy Cheese. I'm probably going to have two pieces of cheese and at least five pieces of turkey. I just really need to get in some protein before my massage so that my belly's full so my body can heal itself, you know, because that's the only way it can do that. Um, so I'm going to eat this and then I have to head out really, really soon, but I'll catch you guys later. So I am back from my massage feeling really good. Makeup stay put. Oh yeah. Go check out my beauty channel, the nothing over $10 makeup tag. That is this video. And I'm going to eat some lunch and you guys, I tried really hard and I made this like really cute lunch for myself and I'm so excited to eat it because it looks so pretty and I tried really hard. So okay, everybody look. Here we go. We have just pretty much a normal salad, but it has um, a chicken patty, like a veggie chicken patty, so it's an actual chicken, half an avocado, a little bit of sharp cheddar cheese, and I put my ranch on the side. I know that's weird, but I did it because I want to dip it in. That way I can control it a little better because I don't like when my lettuce and everything gets soggy with a peach as a side. So I'm going to go enjoy this for lunch. I'm so excited to eat it. Seriously, I'm so hungry. So I'm going to go eat this. Yeah, yum. Okay, so I thought I would give you a little tour of my gym area. So this is the stairs that lead up these, not this, Abby, these. These are the stairs that lead upstairs. Oh, my phone, is it broken? No, it's not, okay, we're good. I dropped it on the way down, it's fine. Okay, these are stairs that lead up to the back. Um, and then this is the gym area and where I'll be filming like our live classes and exercises for my clients and fun stuff. I also do some at the gym, but um, for at home exercise, I film them here. So I have like my rack, my weights. Basically, this is a disorganized, disheveled mess. And I wanted to do a before pan for you guys. And I'm going to try to set this up and make it look really nice and surprise Tim for when he gets home. So he's really excited that he comes down and sees it all like nice and pretty. Um, and yeah, so I'm working on unpacking kind of the whole house today I want to just like really surprise him and make him feel good because I know that the messy house is kind of stressing him out it's definitely stressing me out and and if I get a little bit done today then I can have like a really fun weekend with him and we can go out and do some fun stuff because right now our weekend is set up for like full unpacking which is fine we have like no plans and it's the first weekend we've had no plans in forever um, so yeah I'm going to do this today and then I have to do some macros and new programs for clients. Um, news on my back, it is feeling super bruised after my massage. Like, you know, when you touch it, when you get like a really deep tissue massage, it's just kind of like swollen and it hurts. But overall, I'm actually feeling a lot better. I can move, my range of motion is better, and my muscle doesn't hurt as much. I'm just like bruised from how hard the massage was. It was very, very hard. Um, yeah, it was really crazy. But it was good. I feel better, and I feel ready to like unpack this stuff and get settled in this house. So I'm going to do that, and then I will show you guys the after once it's all done. Whoa, does that look different, you guys. I totally did it. I just finished organizing um, with my back, though, because it does hurt so bad. There are some things that I couldn't move, so I'll just show you what I did. So I pretty much organized everything over there. I have my bike here. I rearranged my bike, and I want my heavy bag to go in the corner. I think that'll be the best place for it because um, it's, like, kind of already that thing sticks out, so it'll, like, fit right in that little corner. Um, so we'll put that there and then have my bike, my bench. This is kind of uh, needs to be a little bit more organized, but it's not so bad, uh, except for that random gym bag up there. I have a mat up there. And then I put um, my bookcase over there with some of my fun sneakers. These are like not workout sneakers. They're Jordans there, but they're like wedge sneakers. Um, 
I have VersaDisc I need to undo. I have this light that I need to move over a little bit, but it is gonna stay here so that when I'm filming exercises and things, um, I can have a little extra light down here. This box Tim needs to move into the laundry room. I, I can't lift it, it's so full of stuff. I have my little weights here, and then my big Bowflex weights over there with my bar, my bench, and then I kind of organized this area a little bit. So I put the coffee tables in there and then the pop -a -son. We are gonna have like a big rug with an L-shaped couch down here eventually, but we wanna get unpacked and like see actually how much room we have. And I think it'll fit nicely. We just wanna make sure that we have enough room with the bike. Um, which I can always move over closer to this wall. So I think we'll have enough room. It'll go like from over there and be L-shaped that way. And we're very excited about it. This is kind of like a fun like game area. So um, Tim has all his Xbox games down here and I was getting ready to start Stranger Things while I unpacked and then I was like so into unpacking, never got to start it. So I'm gonna go work on unpacking the office now um, and take Stranger Things up there with me on my computer and Tati, Glam Life Guru, because I love her. So go check her out. Um, and Tim's dartboard over there. So yeah, you guys, how different does this look from like, well, you saw it like a second ago, but it's taken me about only about 45 minutes. So it was pretty quick. So Yay, 